And Dr. Richard Besser is back live with us this morning. Rich, give us a quick bottom line. Both you and Dr. Oz agree that there's no immediate concern about drinking apple juice? That's right. You know, arsenic is something that's in our, in our world. It's in the air. It's in the soil. It's in, in, in what we eat. All of us take in, through our food, arsenic every single day. And that was, that was what was concerning to me, was pointing to this one food, apple juice, and saying, we have a big concern here, without putting in perspective that arsenic is something that in low quantities has absolutely no problem for health. But part of Dr. Oz's argument is that the public should know, we have a right to know uh, what's in our food. And, and, a, and a point that you do disagree yes. on is that Dr. Oz is adamant about the concern long term. Is there a possibility? I mean, how much apple juice would you possibly have to consume? Do you know? Any idea? You know, it's, it, it's really hard to say because you have to put it in context of your entire diet. Where, what are your sources of arsenic? Where, where are you getting it from? It, it's concerning to me that everyone would come away from this thinking, Arsenic is only in apple juice. Arsenic is something we all take in. We take in small amounts of a lot of things that if you take in, in large quantity are quite dangerous, but in small amounts aren't. He and I agree totally that it's important to look at our food supply, and in particular to ensure that our children are getting things that, that, that are safe. But, but one of the things that didn't come out of this is that the same food safety rules that apply to our growers here apply to those who are, who are exporting to our country. The problem is, and we agree on this, there's not enough inspection of what's going on overseas. Last night, you and Dr. Oz uh, talked with Diane. And he said to you on the air, he said, I want you to come on my program. I want to have this discussion. I want to have this conversation. Will you? Yeah, I, I, I will. I think it's very important, but I want to broaden the conversation because I don't think it's useful for people to think there's only an issue with arsenic. We need to talk about food and food safety, and we're going to do that. And you, you guys are longtime friends. We you are. went to school together. I know you were very upset and very passionate. Yeah. He, is, he felt very strongly about it, but. Yeah, we're still friends. <laughs> All right. All right. Thanks, Rich.